How to make a bifolding door in Revit. Converting a swing door to a bifolding door. Let's start. Open the Revit. Let's make a bifolding louver door for this tutorial. Duplicate louver door from our previous tutorial. Or see the link in the description below. Rename the file. Open. Go to reference level. Go to family types. Change the width to 1800 millimeters and opening angle to 30 degrees. Apply. OK. Select the width parameter. Select new parameter. Name it. Bifold width. OK. Go to family types. Go to bifold width formula. Type. Width over 2. Apply. OK. Select the door. Panel width. Associate family parameter. Select by fold width. OK. Select the door. Select edit family. Go to reference level. Let's save as the family first. Rename the family. Save the family. Select the lever handle. Delete. Select this reference plane. Delete. Next. Draw a reference line. Type VG for visibility graphic overrides. Go to annotation categories. Check reference lines and levels. OK. Dimensions. Select angular dimension. Select this reference plane. And this reference line. Select the dimension. Select new parameter. Name it. Bifold angle. OK. Align or type AL for shortcut. Select this reference plane. Select the blue dot press tab to cycle the selection. Lock. Select this reference plane. Select the blue dot press tab to cycle the selection. Lock. Go to family types. Change the bifold angle to 20 degrees. Apply. OK. Now let's create a door panel placeholder. Go to Create and select Extrusion. Select Set Work Plane. Pick a plane. OK. Set this plane from reference line. Select Pick Lines. Change the offset to 100 millimeters. Pick the reference line. Change the offset value to 0. Pick the reference line. Select the line. Trim or type TR for shortcut. Select the line. Select a line. Select the blue dot press tab to cycle the selection. Select the profile. Lock. Select the reference line. Select the profile. Lock. Dimensions. Make it equal. Dimensions.
Make it equal. Trim or type TR for shortcut. Dimensions. Select the dimension. Go to label. Select the panel thickness. Dimensions. Select the dimension. Go to label. Select the panel width. Finish the extrusion. Select the extrusion. Uncheck visible. Go back to the louver door bifold. Select the door. Select edit family. Load into project and close. Select LD2P by fold. OK. Do you want to save changes? Select No. Select Place on Work Plane. Press Space Bar to rotate the model. Place the model. Select the door. Select Pick New Host. Select Work Plane. Select the reference line. Next. Select a line. Select this edge. Select the center reference of the family. Lock. Select this edge. Select the center reference of the family. Lock. Select the door. And associate family parameters. Go to Edit Type and Associate Family Parameters. OK. Go to Family Types. Let's try to change the bifold angle to 45 degrees. Apply. Let's try 90 degrees. Apply. Perfect. Let's try 30 degrees. Apply. Let's change the panel width to 1400 millimeter. Apply. OK. Go to 3D. Let's check. Save the family. Load into project and close. Select the door. Go to properties. Select LD2P by fold. Select remove constraints. Select the door. Go to Edit Type and Associate Family Parameters. Bifold Angle, Associate Family Parameter, Select New Parameter, Name it, Bifold Angle, Select Instance, 
OK. OK. Apply. OK. Go to Family Types. Go to By Fold Angle Formula. Type. Open and close parenthesis 90 minus opening angle. Times 2. Apply. OK. Now we have a bifold door with an equal angle in opposite direction. Go to 3D. Let's test the parameters. Let's change the width to 1600 millimeters. Change the bottom rail to 200 millimeters. And top rail to 150 millimeters. Let's change also the opening angle to 80 degrees. Apply. Perfect. Let's try 45 degrees. Apply. Perfect. Let's try to change the opening angle to zero. Apply. Perfect. OK. That's it for now. Thank you for watching and have a nice day.